Good morning everyone, Liliana from Vanilla and Canela here. Welcome back to my channel and to another shopping haul. Today I have Tesco's and Waitrose for you. Paul and I have just popped to Waitrose. I had some returns to make and we picked up a few bits that I'd forgotten from my Waitrose grocery haul which is coming later on today. So let me show you what I got in Tesco's. I got some of these Fruit Stars and Fruit Hearts. Alex loves these. They're usually £2 and they were one forty-five. I also got some soft figs. I love munching on these. I saw this. I don't usually buy jar sauces, but it's always nice to have something handy in case you don't need or fancy cooking. All I need to do is just add some chicken to this. Cormant, that was 89p. I also got one thing of pilau rice and I also got some nam, nam breads which I'll show you in a minute. Two boxes of Canadian maple syrup, Nature Valley oat bars, Alex's favourite. I saw this and I thought why not? S'mores kit, I have never tried that. Um, just add water and butter, that sounds really good. Two boxes of flat white pods these are my new favorites so i got some of those two big bags of cat food i went for the senior because my cat my cats are over well one's 15 and the other one's 13 so they go two because they were doing two for eight pounds and then on this side i picked up these tea towels i have been eyeing these tea towels for months but they were six pounds and I was like, do I don't need them, but they are doing them half price. And they look a bit pioneer woman to me. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, it's, it's a lady in the States that has a line of her, a home range line. And I thought these look a bit like the sort of stuff she would do. Tesco had amazing deals going on in their home stuff. So go and check it out. I got some ham, the naan breads I mentioned earlier. I got some mussels for Alex to snack on. I also picked up one of these trolley and locker coins because I We then picked up some smooth duck and orange pate. Paul and I are a bit partial to pate and I got a big baguette over there of tiger bread. So we're just gonna have that with that. I got this to put in my car. Tea mister pad, that was a pound some masking tape, two rolls for £1.25. I got these chocolate twists for a pound. These random sweets were 90p and then a little pint of milk because we're literally completely out of milk and my delivery will bring some more tonight. And also I picked up their magazine this is free to have a look at what they've got inside and I also got a cardigan you all said that this color really suits me and I was looking for a cardigan and this was in the sale for 12 pounds and finally also this lamp for eight pounds okay I liked it because you can actually put decorations inside there and it's a classic design so it will never go off style if you know what I mean. Hello, so I'm ready to show you the Ocado Waitrose delivery. I should point out that we haven't had a food delivery for a couple of weeks so I'm stocking up on a load of stuff that we've run out and to see us through at least two to three weeks. So let me show you. In no particular order we've got some bananas. I also got this three pack of Jaffa cakes they were on offer for a pound something, so I got them. We don't have them very often. I got some dried mango, some seeded batch Warburton's bread. Uh, I did the three, pound, the, the three for ten pounds meat deal, so I got some British beef. Uh, and I'll show you the other two that belong to that offer. But then I saw this pork schnitzel and I decided to give it a go. It, it was, oh, maybe it was part of the three actually. This was part of the three, look, buy any three for £10. Oh, and here's the other one, the organic Dutchy beef. This is really, really good. I really recommend that. 
Um, I also got some unsmoked gammon joint. Alex doesn't like sliced bread, but if sliced ham, sorry, but if I cook it, excuse if you can hear Paul and Alex playing in the background, but anyway, so, but if I cook it like this, he'll eat it. So I decided to buy a joint, a joint of gammon, sorry, <laughs> some potatoes. They do the milk three for two pounds. So I got three two pinters. There's also some shoulder steaks at the back there. And then some smoked cooking chorizo. I love this stuff. It just adds flavor immediately to any dish. There's some avocados. These are for Paul. I'm not a massive fan of avocados. If I know, I know they're really good for you, but there's also some sliced cheese. Some yogurt, Greek style yogurt. This is peach passion fruit. Uh, these are for me. I also picked up this. This was before I went to Tesco's this morning. I ordered all this stuff last night. And I've never actually tried this Cortado Espresso Macchiato, but it looks really good. And it is 16 pods. So if you have, if you ever bought these, sometimes you can get. Um, only eight pods if it's a latte it has a milk and the coffee this one is all in one so I thought I'd give it a try I picked up Paul loves apple crumble so I got that look at that perfect for two Alex wouldn't eat that it was only a pound I got these two pepper steak style pies I didn't realize they were meat free but you know it is what it is so we'll have those two things a bicarb soda i also saw this one off i think this was a pound apple pear and cucumber it just sounds delicious i'm not a huge fan of smoothies but that just sounded really good got some frozen mashed potato i also got some swedish well it is product of sweden i think that's probably what it says there um fresh yeast and Sophie, if you are watching this, I know one of you, uh, um, one of you, a lady called Sophie, is of Swedish. Can you tell me, can I freeze this? Um, anyway, so fresh yeast, some passion fruit, some apples, some tangerines. And then let me take you over. I'll show you that in a bit. But up here, got some crumpets. These are sourdough crumpets, which are delicious. Got some um, kitchen paper, picked up some four salted caramel billionaire, like biscuity cake things, a loaf of tiger bread, some mustard for Paul, some pan au chocolat, some cheesy puffs. I'm going through a revival. By that I mean, I mean, really enjoying them. I had them at my friend Carly's house and I was just thinking wow that tastes amazing so I got some to have here I also got the offer on the popcorn these were three for three pounds and um, so I got two sweet and salty and one chocolate last time I got the vanilla coconut and I didn't like that very much so I got this selection now I also picked up this which I've never used before it's a coffee machine cleaner odorless and taste free clean and to scale so I'm going to put that through my coffee machine the rediffusers were half price so I think this one was four pounds and it smells really good I like putting one of these in a downstairs loo and also got some sparkling water that was on offer it was only I think something like a pound 89 for a six I really love drinking fizzy water but not all the time so I didn't want to buy a big bottle and then it loses the fizz Okay, I'm going to put some of this stuff away and then I'll show you the rest which is on the floor here. Okay, and then finally I got four soya milks for Paul and three long life milks. I went with me because they were on offer. So I think it, it basically worked out cheaper than the normal uh, brand. So I went with that. I also got a big bottle, sorry about the lighting, of extra virgin olive oil that was an extremely good deal it was something like three pounds when it's usually seven big 
bag of pom bears for Alex. And then I also got an iron. This is a Russell Hobbs light and easy brights. It's mango color, which I don't mind. Basically, the only person that uses an iron in this house is Paul when he uh, irons his uniform and ours had broke when he went away. So I've not needed to use it for four months, but I know he will need to use it this weekend to iron up all his clothes ready for work. And this was 20 pounds. It was on offer at half price. It's usually 40 and it's a good brand. I thought this would be okay. And then lastly, some Andrex toilet paper. Again, it was on offer and there was a three, three rolls free. So I got that. Like I said before, this will last us a good two and a half to three weeks. And I spent just over a hundred pounds. So with, you know, bearing in mind that 20 went on the iron. I think I got quite a lot of stuff. Looking a bit as usual. Anyways, you guys, I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And if you're new, please don't forget to subscribe. See you guys next time. Bye.